an accident puts someone in the hospital for six months where they have to recover and they have the time to actually look at the world around them with a new set of eyes, a fresh outlook and a, uh, you know, a, a new lease on life. And all of a sudden they rebuild their lives in a way that is around truth. And, you know, it's, it's amazing to see, you know, uh, the, the, the kinds of transformations people go through when, when they, are given the opportunity, but some dude that's just doing the nine, I mean, doing the corporate thing and climbing the ladder and trying to buy the next thing and, and all of that kind of stuff. It's like hard to see when they're going to get the opportunity to rip into any of these things, you know, and see to, to pop their head up and say, what's, what is this that I'm living in? And that's what I do to a certain extent on Facebook. You know, I'll post things that are not necessarily flat earth to my friends, but I'll post like the big blue marble and I'll say, this is not a photograph. This is actually a composite that is from this. And here's an actual quote so that like some of a lot of my friends are are engineers or, uh, you know, professors in college and stuff like that. And and, you know, I just want them to, you know, one little nugget might get them to say, oh, that doesn't look right like that, that uh that lunar module does not look right, or that blast off from the moon looks uh, like uh, a, a, a production of some sort. You, you know the the blast off when they nineteen seventy yes yeah, yeah. like fireworks I mean, and they're fireworks yeah 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 oh my gosh I mean, you know I talked to an astrophysicist one night at, with some other flat earthers and we showed him that video of the blast off from the moon with the little fireworks and he was like and he thought we faked it he was like that's not real you guys are showing me fake stuff 